ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Santa's Workshop. Today, yes, we have another review. I promise you're going to see a, a video before this one on a car. I promise. But anyways, we got someone new on the channel. Let me introduce you to my son-in-law. How's it Nathan. going? Oh, you're 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 looking a little. Uh, Big we'll back up there. Yeah. There we are. There he is. How's it going? Doing all right, Nathan. How are you today? Doing just fine. So you're going to start helping me a little bit, huh? Yeah, buddy. I'm excited. So we're going to we're going to we're going to test him out on a new e-bike. <laughs> and the maker of this e-bike, Oriamo, said this is the Oriamo Scrambler 100. Uh, their number is the number on it is OEK 5330N. And they want me to do it as an off-road bike. Well, you look out here, we have plenty of area to off-road. So, we're going to unbox this thing, and we're going to stick Nathan on it. We're going to find some off-road. We're going to find some off-road. So, let's get busy. All righty, Nathan. Let's get into this thing. Let's do it. I mean, they're only copper staples. No, I think they put glue on this as well. Oh, golly. Definitely not going to come apart in transit. Wow! Yeah, that, that was definitely well packed, in. wasn't it? Look in there. That looks All good. Right. We've got our box of goodies oh, right we there. Take a package in the way. There. there we go. All right, how about it? <laughs> <laughs> Let me have that. To watch my background on this. Yeah, they packed it really well. All right. So we do it. Yep, just grab it. Bring it out. All right. Set it right over there. They even brought a seat. Have a seat. How nice of them. I'll take that. That's a cap for something. Uh, the center spoke there, I think. Well, I'll check Put you that out. Right there. All right. All right, this is going to take a little more putting together than my last one, but that's all right. I bet you we can handle it. Hey, I know where that cap goes. About right there. There you go. All right. You want some cutters? Hang on a second. Looks like a bike. All right. Did we do something right? I think we did something right. Okay. Can't forget the gas pedals. No, can't, can't forget those. Never, never. Okay, we'll tighten all oh, this. Look up. at that. They just no backup nut or nothing. They just thread right in. Right. 
Righty tidy, lefty loosey. Yeah, it's got a burr on it. Ah. Got a bench grinder with a brush over there. I can find that thread there. Hold it. Hang on. Let me see something. What's up? Okay. We have a lot to learn. What you got? What does that say? <laughs> What's the green L mean? <laughs> How about the left side? Boy, that works a lot better, doesn't Much it? Much <laughs> better. You know what Where's they call that, that wrench? What's that? Content. Oh, yeah? I thought it was metric. <laughs> what we have power how much juice we got full charge it comes with a full battery full folks. that's like buying a car and getting a full tank of gas which you know and these trying times okay that's okay. everything and then some now hang on one second we're gonna turn this up where they can see us sure stand behind the back all right since you are going to be the pilot. Yeah, buddy. Driver. Cyclist, I believe. Cyclonist. Victim. Cyclist. Yeah. So. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay. Here's your battery level. Okay. Light on and off. All right. This doesn't have a light. Not so. seeing a headlight on this Okay. One. Error code. You okay. hope you don't see that. No, we don't want to see that. Speed unit. All right. There's your speed. Cruise control. You know how to do the cruise control, right? Yes. Okay. Yeah. You turn it on for so far. Uh huh. Ooh. This thing's right ready over to, that. Side. This thing's ready to go. It is ready to go. <laughs> torquey, torquey. All right. There's your boost, cruise control, value unit, odometer. This is your up and down. All right. Your uh, house. Your gear. Okay. Your gear. And then everything's you, indicated in that one little unit. I yep. like that. Yeah. Very bright. Let me get the camera over here so you can see that. Very bright control. I mean, I, that, I think you'll be able to see that in bright sunlight pretty I think easy. So. so, all right, let's take a look at what all we have on this. We got your brakes. Front brakes. That's your front brakes, the throw. Yep, it grabs. Hit Rear brake. brakes. Rear brake works. Here's your manual gear select for your, when you're cycling. Um, here's your up and down. Oh, that's, that's how you adjust it right there. You got shows your average, your trip, your odometer, your max, and your average for your battery power. Yep. That's clever. Okay, let's do the odometer. And this one right here. Brightness. Ah. How about that? It, it'll dim it down when you're at night. So, okay. Because, you know, it'll be too bright by then. Exactly. All right, I mean, this is pretty, a, pretty much a basic bike but it's for off-road. It's a beefy looking bike. It's a beefy looking bike. It feels nimble too, my goodness. Okay. We're going to check the air of the tires and oh, yeah. we're going to get him set up, take a test run. Are you ready? We're going to get it. All right. All right, what did you just tell me? Eye protection, so you look cool, not necessarily for your safety. <laughs>
All righty. Now, Nathan. Yeah, buddy. Your mic is on. All right. So I'm if, going to. If you get scared. Uh huh. No cursing. Gotcha. <laughs> Gotcha, gotcha. I don't even know what cursing is. Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> All right, I'm going to go give it a shot here. All right. Here we Whoa, go. Whoa, that's a lot of torque already. <laughs> right off the rip, first gear. He's got a lot. So for no struts in the front, it's a really smooth ride. That's what those tire, big tires are good for. Haven't even gotten second gear yet. <laughs> I'll be back in a sec. Okay, here it comes. Woo. I saw dirt fly. It is really, really torquey. Is it? it is very responsive too. Okay. I had the fr I had the front brake engaged so I could slow down and give it some, and it actually just tried to spin tire on me. So. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Here's oh, what yeah. we're going to do. What are we going to do with it? We're going to open that gate right over there. Turn me loose on it. I'm ready. We got a terrace out there. Okay. We got some rough ground. All right. And be look out. There's granite chunks out there too. Uh, okay. All right. So. We're going to stop it. We're going to go over here, open the gate, and we're going to let you loose in there. Sure. A smooth enough ride that I did it one-handed to get some pictures of how fast it went. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay. So, I got 24.4, and I didn't leave third gear. That was the highest I went. Okay. 24.4. In second gear, I'm 22.2 .2 mile an hour. Oh, my gosh. Where? Where is it? 23, and there's 23 in second gear. I never left third gear yet. You still have it? Yeah. And it was 23. 24 is as fast as I went in third gear. I didn't leave, I didn't want to leave it back there because I had some good washboard now, happening. I do see that this thing is drinking down the battery a lot quicker yeah. than they normally do. But How many miles do you think I've gone? Probably, well, probably four. Oh yeah, there we go. Let's How see. handy, right? Let's see. 2.1 miles. You got 2.1 miles on a on a oh. shipping charge. That's not bad at all. Nope. All right, gate is open. Just my all back right. brake a little bit. Okay. Real easy adjustments too, my goodness. Just thumb screws, real nice, all right. All right, now, if you look over there, yep, that's that block of granite I was warning you about. All right, we'll try not to hit that. And, and there's some hidden in the grass too, so. Okie doke. Be careful. <laughs> we'll see what fares better, me or the bike. <laughs> Here we go. That is definitely some rough ground right there.
kill that for a sec. Oh, was that that pop that I <laughs> Yeah, heard? that's what it was. Oh! I'm going to tighten that up just a little bit more. It's not surprising. I was hitting some pretty big holes. Yeah, well, when you first took out down through there, uh -huh. you were bouncing. <laughs> yeah. Oh, do you hear that rumbling overhead? Sounds like it might rain. Oh, oh, I see rain coming out right there. Oh, that looks beautiful. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Oh, there's your sunset. All right. I'm going to go hit that again. Yeah, it was really bumpy. You can tell some cattle have been walking through that area right there. Well, see, that, that floods out every time it rains really good. That's a good spot for this, for sure. How's it feel going over that terrace? You talking about this one right here? No, the, the big hit. Felt like it all, I kind of felt like it got some air. Well, guys, this bike is just so stinking light. It is nothing for it to get air. It has a harder time pulling you than pulling itself. I'm gonna get a jump here. Oh yeah. Got a pretty good jump on that one. Some really rough terrain right through here. You can probably hear it in my voice. Yeah! <laughs> oh yeah, I got some pretty good air on that one. I've done a lot of dirt bikes in the past and this is my first time playing e-bike it's nice it's quiet it's really smooth for not having gas struts in the front or the rear it's a relatively smooth ride that gas strut in the seat really helps out i want to get this jump right here oh yeah oh that's nice yeah, it's just, it, it's nothing to launch this bike, fellas, I'm telling you. I'm playing on it for about, oh, I don't know, an hour or so. Got myself about a good, good half a charge anyway. Handling pretty rough terrain pretty well. Battery's holding up good, and I haven't even left the first gear, folks. I'm still in the second, or still in the zero, excuse me. Oh yeah, that's a lot of fun. Well, that's I think that, that might be funner than driving a gas. I'll tell you, it's, <laughs> it's nowhere near as heavy. It's so much more nimble. It's a it's, lot torquier. It, yeah, it's it's much more responsive than gas. I mean, for what the bike is, it's an, it's it's very responsive. It's it's so light. It has no problem getting any any kind of jumps. I just jumped this three or four times. <laughs> it, it, I'm kind of at a loss for words, really. I didn't expect electric to take to take to this kind of terrain that well, <laughs> but and climbing steep, it doesn't even it doesn't care it doesn't care how steep it is, it climbs it. So, overall impressions of it, I'm I'm very impressed. Yeah, like I've I've heard a lot about the e-bikes. I never really kind of thought once or twice about it because you know. I'm an auto technician. I've ridden a lot of dirt bikes and uh, a lot of gassers, and uh, this is second e-bike I've been on, and I'm very impressed with it. Oriamo, thank you for sending it to us. Link will be down below in the description. But guys, say hi to Nathan. He's going to be back more often. It's been a blast, fellas. Hey, and he's going to try and start his own YouTube. So his stepson is the proud owner of the Midnight Express. So guess what? You may be seeing it again real soon. Thank you much. We'll see you next time. Have Let's a good one, guys. <laughs> oh, dude. You